Well, tech firms say it's likely too late to rein in the development of artificial intelligence, despite warnings it could bring about our extinction. A recent open letter signed by high-profile figures warns catastrophe could be around the corner if AI is left to develop unchecked. But as our Asia correspondent Brent O'Halloran reports, big players, including a trillion-dollar valued company, are banking on the controversial technology. At Asia's biggest computer expo... That will be your exclusive AI booth tour guide today. All the talk is on one area of tech. We're going to use our AI training model. It's an AI-powered autopilot. There are a lot of beneficial things about AI. The latest hardware that powers it and the newest products that harness it are on display in Taipei as more than 1,000 Computrex exhibitors and industry heavyweights spruik the potential of artificial intelligence. We have now reached the tipping point of a new computing era. This is going to touch literally every single industry. Though others paint a more dire picture. Dozens of experts, including developers of popular AI products, this week signed this open letter saying, mitigating the risks of extinction from AI should be a global priority alongside other societal scale risks, such as pandemics and nuclear war. Right now, companies are competing with each other to develop this most powerful AI system. And what they're doing is they're prioritizing the development of AI over its safety. So they're locked in this race and just like the nuclear arms race, this could also potentially lead to catastrophe. Yet Taiwan is going all in on AI, leveraging the local talent and infrastructure as a world leader in computer chip production. We are not just ready to join. We are ready to lead it in the AI age. Taiwan's also arguably at most risk to AI's dangers. Deep fakes and disinformation, often powered by AI tools, are common. While Chinese hackers use any exploits to attack the territory Beijing wants to take over. This technology might be appropriated by the digital authoritarian country, which is just next to Taiwan. AI software is now ubiquitous, and as the products on display here illustrate, computer hardware is getting more and more powerful, meaning it's becoming harder and harder to limit AI's development and its potential impacts. The cat is kind of out of the bag, so I don't know how they can restrict it, to be honest. It's definitely a bit scary how fast it is improving, but we're definitely excited to be a part of it. Maybe it replaces uh, workers or maybe a lot of employees. They say that maybe it will make the humankind go extinct. So I will beat the AI. I'm not, not afraid of the robots, OK? <laughs> Artificial intelligence has long been fodder for science fiction. Now experts are presenting a binary choice regarding our future alongside this controversial computing field. That is, we either work smartly with AI, or it one day has us deleted. Brent O'Halloran, Sky News in Taipei.